Hi Because Beauties, Lisa Nilsson, brand makeup artist for Because Cosmetics, and I am talking about the Academy Awards show. So this is my Because Beauty Report, and I've put together four different looks based on the makeup that I observed last night. So I wanted to start out with Jennifer Lawrence. So we're gonna walk through eyes, cheeks, and lips real quick just based on the makeup and show you how you can recreate it. So this is the Supernatural Nude Palette. Jennifer had a very dramatic wing, if you remember. You could easily accomplish that wing by using these two of the dark brown shades. And then you also noticed on her that she had a beautiful gold shade at the inner corner to create interest and texture and really light up her eye. You'll also notice that she had a very dramatic wing. This is easily accomplished by using our iconic black liner, the gel liner. You could do top and bottom, waterline above and below, and then just wing it out. Because remember, wing liner is not a product, it's a technique. It's also not limited to certain colors, so just some insight there. Blush-wise, something comparable to our apricot flush. This is, a, again, a silky long wear. It gives a very pretty, healthy look to the cheek without too much color. Jennifer was wearing a classic red lip, comparable to that of Rebel Red and Classic Red. I'm gonna show those to you real quick. Those are gorgeous, they're timeless, they'll never go out of style. I wanted to talk a little bit about Sandra Bullock's look. So to start with eyes, she had a chocolatey brown shade. This is the Smoke and Mirrors palette. Chocolate brown above and below and a smoky eye. Uh, definitely some liner uh, both above and below and you notice on Sandra she had a beautiful silvery shade at the inner corner to brighten the eye now whenever we do a dramatic eye we want to offset it with more of a soft toned down lip so we saw something comparable to nearly nude with the au natural liner on her which is slightly darker so it gives nice shape and fullness to the lips cheeks wise I love that I saw kind of a rosy look to her cheekbone, and this again, gorgeous on and silky long wear throughout the day. Um, I wanna move on to Mary J. Blige, who also was wearing more earth tones, also did a gold at the inner corner. Beautiful colors above and below, nice smoky shades here on her as well. But what you'll notice with her look is she had more of a nude or a white liner at the bottom on the waterline, but she rimmed underneath more with like a brown shade to really keep the eye nice and full. So you could certainly accomplish that with something like this from the Supernatural Nude Palette. Additionally on Mary J. Blige, we saw a beautiful plummy kind of cheek. So Sherry Kiss, great for Beautiful skin. I think that all skin tones can wear Sherry Kiss as long as it's applied carefully. This is a Vava Vino, great lip color, and guess what? I created this little duo, Nearly Nude and Vava Vino, would be a comparable lip to what Mary J. Blige was wearing. It looked so fun. You'll never know if you're gonna like a liner with a really lighter lipstick unless you try it. So give that a try. And then lastly, Nicole Kidman, who I thought really stole the show and looked amazing. Again, Earth Tones, really classic beauty last night. Not too harsh, not too much. The difference though with Nicole's look is she kept all of the definition, the depth and darkness above. She really didn't have any liner underneath at all. Um, she kept all of these beautiful dark tones, more in matte finishes above and then additionally she had big you know lashes on nice long lashes and healthy fluffy brows so those are some ways that i would define her look on the cheeks we see something comparable to pink reverie so pink cheek with again a classic red lip so something like rebel red and classic red on Nicole Kidman's look. So really fun ways to replicate the looks that we saw last night. What I saw that was in common with all of these is really healthy, luminous skin. Not too heavy coverage either, not matte and masky. So our hydrating foundation is a great way to accomplish that luminous, gorgeous look to the skin to where it's your skin 
but it still looks like you and you shine through. The last thing that these ladies probably all had in common was a setting spray, right? Because we know that this gives so much more longevity, it gives a nice seal and set. So our fix and finish spray would be a great way to accomplish that for your own personal after party and award show. So I hope this has been helpful. Feel free to reach out if you have questions and let us know what you thought about the Academy Awards show and what some of the looks were that stood out to you. Until then, I'll talk to you soon. Thanks.